Just a quick check in today. Sunsetting, seeing the sunset. And feeling really good. Um, I woke up feeling really. Yeah, the moon and Aries and all that. I know some of you don't believe in astrology and stuff. You... Hey, hey, Victor, how are you? Love you. Love you too, ma. Um, yeah, I'm feeling good. I, you know, this this a bit. I think you just wanted the attention. I think the sun just wanted the attention. It just wanted to be not setting behind, you know, where I can't see. But I think you want to focus on me, you know, and I don't subscribe. I don't, I don't, because I don't know with the sun and the eyes and all this. I remember people said, don't look into the sun or the sun can make you blind. I've been looking into the sun since I was a child, literally into the sun. My sight is not the best it could be. I used to have beyond 2020 vision. It was like 20. 10 or 20 whatever now it's probably like i mean you know like one eye is nearsighted one eye is farsighted i don't know you know you you do what you do and it affects you some kind of way just like food okay that's why i oh that is so beautiful man you gotta it's well let's see All right nope gotta do that you would think i'd learn my phone <laughs> I know I've learned the damn phone. Like, why come you can't take a picture of, of what you want to take a picture of? Beauty anywhere. Anyway, anyway. Look at my baby. My baby. My baby. My baby. Lily. Lily that I uh brokered the deal. Again, shout out to Brag Mutual. You guys are you guys are the best. I uh oh man, that is gorgeous is it's like right after the sun is setting but it's like right after the sunset people who are in real life you know people who have the narrative of the sunset right but this is the thing the sun sets like the sun rises over oh the birds wait wait turn turn off me the oh look at the birds flying over me Nature showing everybody showing off today. You see, you see, you see, you see, you see, way up in the sky that spaceship over there. Anyway, uh, back to me. Thank you, mom and dad. Thank you, nature. I needed that today because I've been feeling some kind of way. You know, the last person you need to threaten is me. The last bitch you need to ever threaten in your entire. Take yourself. Don't do it to yourself. I'm rapping for my health. They tried to get my wealth. Better know about themselves. Because mess with me can be bad for your health. You know what I'm saying? I'm just saying an actuality. I'm not saying I do magic. I am the magic, darling. Yes, the magic is me. Yo, yo. Yo, yo, yo. yo. The, alg the algorithms can't take it today. Who is the AI? The AI might be me, but I know one thing. The AI can lie, especially when the technology... Ooh, the people that try to steal the technology, and they try to steal the technology to steal your identity, too. And they even want to try to steal up on you. And they send a whole bunch of people that they call it their crew. And then you know what they do? They try to force you into some bullshit. And then they wonder, how in the hell did I get hit? Because you fucked with the wrong bitch. Anyway, ooh, sorry, mother, but it's just friendly fire. Because <laughs> I'm that kid. Top gun chick. So who the fuck want to mess with me today? But I'm not spitting out my shoe. See, it's the stuff that you don't hear. It's the stuff that you don't hear. But those who need to hear it do. You know... When somebody is really, really good to you, you want to try to keep that person around. But when somebody kind of fucks you over, you want to put that person down. That's what I learned from my mom and my dad. More so, it's the stuff you don't hear and you don't see. I mean, I just did a whole freaking rap. But, you know, R.I.P. to the rap industry. What they don't know about me. Mm -hmm. I'm just a little, I'm just a little old chick sitting classified in Area 53. 
<laughs> trying to get these colds away, these ghosts too. But you know what? The ghosts, my hubby and my mommy and my daddy, they be coming through. Ooh, and shout out to the military, the 82nd Airborne, the real ones, okay? I love you so much. Legacy, legacy, legacy. They don't know what's up, but I do. And I am so thankful for all of you and my crew. I'm just saying, ooh, do we talk about them? Not them, the other ones. I mean, you know, organizations and organizations, two different things. See, the organization, well, you know what? They know who they are. I don't have to like, they know who they are. We've been chilling since maybe forever, but definitely since seven. Did I find you or did you find me? Anyway, I'm talking about the we won't talk about it, but I'm just saying that's why I'm not, I'm never afraid of the Illuminati. Like, you think like the Illuminati started shit? Bitch, no, no, no. You're going to do, you're going to do what? Okay, mother. She says, chill back. Because today I was like, I just, I woke up this morning and I felt everything. It was like, it was like people that I actually helped. People that smiled in my face. People that I actually cared about. I took some time. I'm like, it, I, like did I waste my time on some bullshit? I got to take the accountability because that fault was me. Because I talked to anybody, even a goddamn tree. But the tree is not gone down. But people might be. Anyway, see, stuff like that you don't always hear or see. But you want to hear the stereotype, right? Like, look at me. I'm sitting up here in the hood, and it's all good. I don't have to sit in some fancy house and be lying. You know, these preachers and these doctors and these politicians, all these people, they be smiling. Why? Because they're the ones that you can't get up into their pockets like that. But they want to be all up in the mind. They want to make rules and decisions every time. Not a goddamn one of them have been overseas or fought in a war. But they want to be big ass gangsters over here on these shores. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, and fuck you too. And I'm, I make, they can't maybe always speak for them, but I can, and so I do. I'm just saying, you better watch how you play military and military brats because god damn it motherfucker when we clap back we clap back with facts but still we clap back you know what i mean like i said guns plus no i'm very legal on the team so when i say I, when they told me why don't you shoot in the tree but the tree didn't bother anybody especially me that tree has protected me in so many ways that tree has deflected lightning off at least several times okay so i mean why should i why should i shoot into something that has actually helped me but as opposed to shooting to somebody who's tried to like fuck me Now, I look like the I wrote by, don't I? I might just be. And they ain't no Will Smith, so ain't that some shit. But anyway, <laughs> who wants to get hit today? No, truth has something to say. And truth is on a sleigh. But yo, you got all oh, my life. These people be talking about some bullshit and now they mad at me. You know what you did and so does daddy too. And my mommy too makes three. So yo, go ahead and do what you do. I don't have a problem with you. I'm just trying to figure out why you have a problem with me. When I helped you for free? And you gonna kill me for a contract for nothing for money? Okay, that money now is coming out of everybody's asses. Ain't it funny? Dun, 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 dun. Who's J Lo now? Who's Jenny from the block now? Like I ain't good. I ain't do anyway. I guess I just had something to say. Shout out to military mom. It's okay. You know what? I don't. You know, I know. It's, I felt that too today because you had other stuff to handle. I think I did too, and I needed to fuse. So I'm sending love to you. You HBCUs need to get on your. You need to get on your shit because you've lost it. You're not even what you used to be. So you have the nerve to flaunt HBCU at, to me. I can give you some HBCU horror stories. I'm just saying. You know what? The good teachers, the good professors, you like just pass on by and the fucked up ones you just like lift them up to the sky and then you want to turn around and ask me to donate money to you i mean like bitch why because that's what you're all acting like right now a bunch of bitches when you had the history right there you just let it go away so i'm supposed to support you know the, the foe and the fae and the fae and the foe but not me i'm the faith and it's that too why does every religious organization want to change up your name when i already had a name for you my parents named me faith but you wanted to change me into something else and that's each and every single organization who did who wanted me to be something in spite of myself like i'm supposed to be someone to make your wealth but you're going to use my energy see that's why i don't do organizations see but there is one organization who's been looking out for me and that's why i ain't scared about anybody because maybe that's all flowing through me and either way i'm saying i'm just so blessed about my legacy and either wherever i be it's going to be all good because i might date i might die tonight you know what you never know 
but I'm going to die on my own feet, standing up. You want to fight me? Come on. <laughs> I'm little, but I'm tough. You want to throw bones? <laughs> I throw fire. What's up? You went for Jesus to come out in the sky? Jesus could come in a cherry bomb, okay? I'd watch that if I were you, but you know what? Y'all don't remember World War World War One or World War Two. Especially these new millennials and you you little gen kids, Gen Z kids and millennials and stuff. You need you need to watch some of these gang motherfuckers out. Only all they do is go to jail in and out, in and out, in and out in jail, like they're in and out, in and out, in and out hoes, spreading S T D and God only knows. Got their kids selling blow and then they wanna come around and fuck with my dope. Bitch, do you know I'm crazy enough to kill everybody? <laughs> no, but really, I'm just it's just me spitting out some friendly fire, but ask my real friends about me. Yeah. <laughs> Who might those real friends be? I don't know. I feel the mosquitoes coming out, these little blood suckers. They always come out when the sun goes down. Don't let the sun go down on me. Man, I'm feeling some Elton John today. I'm going to go in and play that song, take a shower, another one, and uh, I'm just going to chill for the rest of the night. And I just finished, you know, paying off my taxes, right? Some of them. I got more to do next month. But the fact is, I can do it and without a stunt. And who has helped me with the fact that these people have done what they did when they knew I was struggling by myself when they knew they can't say they didn't know they can't say I didn't tell the truth they cannot say that I lied to them in their face they cannot say that I didn't even help their youth they cannot say that I have been good for the block they cannot say but they might because they do what they do so don't stop doing you but I'm just saying when you think you're gonna do it on me bitch remember I'm not a part of your family tree you and me are not the same Treat me as I am, not a bitch that's lame, because I bet you before you die, you're going to remember my name. You know what I'm saying? Ha, ha. It's the Newman blood coming out of me. I don't know. It's Bob Jones Jr. That it could be. My mama, too, remind you, my mom was really in the military, too, and a healer, a real healer, not a dope dealer, not a heroin dealer, not a like, I think I take some heroin, some shrooms today so I can open myself up to what, bitch? To what? Booty ass, faggot ass, motherfucker. You don't know. Okay, I got it, mother. It's Friday. Freya. <laughs> Find out who Freya is. Freya is for Friday, so I'm representing Freya today. Free ya. Free your mind. Free your mind, and your ass will follow. But don't don't come for mine. <laughs> This ass is certified and classified in Area 53. You know what? Nobody gonna fuck with me. My daddy, my mama, and my hubby says that, as well as the real military. You wanna know why these planes fly over me and these helicopters too? Because maybe they know just what I might do. <laughs> is she a real alien or is she crazy? I don't know. What do I look like I am? Private property. So who wanna fuck with me? The wrong way. Why are you jealous today? You got the cars, the bitches, the bras, and everything else. You supposedly have the bars, but what bars do you have? How many people? I'm letting it go, but I'm just saying, yo, where they at now? Where are you? Where you are? 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 If I fell on hard times, who could I depend on? That's when I started to really see how these motherfuckers in 2022 will be in 2023. Now, I don't need... Ain't stupid, ain't lying. Nino Brown, I just might be. <laughs> I don't know when that other energy comes out of me. Thanks for real. <sighs> I don't know, officer. I just blacked out and I just there was just dead bodies everywhere. I don't know. I have these blackout moments. <laughs> I just don't care. I told you I'm in my mid heaven Aquarius. Like, like, like Santa, we give no fucks. So if you want to live a longer life, these mosquitoes, these little blood suckers, they love my blood. But you know what? That's okay. Eat up, bitch. Because <laughs> you eat and then you die. <laughs> you suck my blood and you will fry. Okay, that's all I had to say today. That was a freestyle Friday. It's a freestyle Friday. Now, you kill a fire of bars and yo, boom. I'm just a little old lady. I'm just a little old 67 year old sitting on a block with my with my natural locks. Not some pissy ass hoe that fucked her way to the top. That is gender not specific. You know what I mean? Understand what they talking about. That's what I'm talking about right there. 
It's the eyes and the skies and the protection everywhere. I love it. 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 And I see a spider coming down off the pole, too. Wow, that's wild. Wow. That is wild. I got it. Did you? Have a good evening. Good Friday.